Hello boys and girls, this is Nagidal and we are on KF Perrin's survival multiplayer server. Uh, this time, um, as you saw, well, you will see unfamiliar structure, but that's because we are on the new map. Well, this time we are going to see Lemon Bean's house. Lemon Bean, not Lemon Beam. I hope he is somewhere around. Yes, he is. Yes. So, Lemon Bean, give us a tour around your house. Uh, when I saw it, I thought this must be recorded because it has um, a very interesting design. As you see, again, ordinary materials, nothing fancy, yet the house uh, per se is quite good. What I like especially and what is so remarkable about this and what made me record it is this are things above the windows, these covers. Mm, that gives the house a special feature, a um, characteristic feature actually because there is no town requiring such window covers or window rooflets, <laughs> I don't know how to call them. I really should uh, acquire lots of architectural vocabulary. Yes, much of it, I need much of it uh, in, uh, in my Minecraft videos. We see here a simple pool, um, carefully designed with this snow border. I wonder what this snow border means. It can't be really s snow. Uh, something like a white line, white whatever. I wonder what that could be. If you had a garden with a pool surrounded by um, by uh, sand, just uh, to um, well, just to <clears throat> have a walk around it. What would be this white thing? I don't know. So people are having party. How do we get out of this pool? Ah, this way. Hmm. Hey, when we go, go out, we see checkered pattern floor. Looks like all over the house are checkered floors. This is certainly something inviting. I'll take a bite of it. Look at this nice fireplace. I don't know what this button is. Could be a little picture as well. And discussion room. <laughs> Brickstone fireplace. Uh huh. Another fireplace. How many places you have? Oh. Lock two is con is ex um, examining it very carefully. Everything with his glasses put on and his inspecting uh, looks. Mm. Certainly something, this, this wool block uh, above the fireplace. 
What did lemon bean say actually? Just two, okay. Mm -hmm. Buttons, buttons, what next? Ah, little library here. This is nice. I only have a, a book a sh shelf or book, one bookshelf or yeah, a piece of furniture. You, you can see it in the there in the background. It's a uh, it's not like multiple rows of such things holding books. Um, where is Lemon? Show us more of this house. Now this is interesting. I don't know what this is. It's not a kitchen, is it? Something like a workshop for tools and doing stuff, crafting stuff. This is this is actual workshop here in this house. Where well, are where is everybody? They are up, upstairs. I should, probably we should go upstairs. Hmm. Checkered pattern, yet another checkered pattern. So this checkered patterns vary, not to make it too boring and to so you know where you are. Practical storage. Although somewhat far from the workshop, but here are crafting benches as well, so you can craft here. Now what's this room? Ah, computer. <laughs> Very nice. Uh, the ice cube as a monitor or a screen. Mm -hmm. Mouse pad? No, it's, I guess Lemon Bean is right handed. He will move his mouse where Log 2 stands. This is. The toolbox probably represents the computer itself. What is this? Ah! Another staircase. I'm really tired. I'm yawning all the time here. Or at least I'm, I want to yawn. <laughs> Sorry. It's not because it's boring, because it's 2 a.m. and I, um, I have to sleep some, somewhere. Now, this is. Yes, I, I've seen this room. It's nicely decorated with this lamp on, on the soft table here, or at least could be interpreted as a table covered with um, a tablecloth. And this is, looks like a comfortable seat in front of a well, picture, but this picture is so dark due to a glitch in Minecraft, lighting glitch, that I first thought, is this a Sorry. Is this a TV screen? Is this, could this possibly be a TV? I don't know. I certainly would like it as a TV. So this could be the TV room and some and a mushroom to eat for a special experience while watching Koyanis Katsi or similar films. And this is the sleeping room, I guess. Look how much more comfortable this bed looks when it has wool blocks beside it. Grey wool blocks. I never think that they they are so comfortable. <laughs> okay. Uh, now, yes, and this about this bed we have. Um, now we can't see it from here, but this is hmm, a cover. Not all beds have it. Does does your have if your bed have it? Balcony, one of the few balcon one of the little balconies. Then there are larger ones. We have seen them from out from the outside. This this is this is the larger balcony. Very nice with these 
support here multiple story uh, balcony we have another balcony yet another level higher up I hope we will get to it Mm -hmm. So this is probably the highest level, highest floor, at least the highest floor where you can live. Not much space here, but I think we have seen still. Look how, how this house is lit with combination of um, glowstone and and torches I I have never bothered to light up my house with these glowstone lamps yet if they look quite nice I like that lemon bean has decided to use them and this is the very attic or the very roof of the house mm -hmm. what is there big construction going on mm -hmm. So this is also where you can have a nice view on the at the night sky. Mm -hmm. I like the design of the house from from the outside. From the outside, it looks nice. Uh, here, even though Lemon Bean has tried to differentiate the rooms by different checkered patterns I feel lost in this house and these checkers are boring me cold bath oh, that, that's nice um, that's that's a well-designed room cold, that was a good, good idea to have a cold bath at, at home and ice blocks having down there I like these pressure plates uh, they they probably represent such mats you have when you get out of your uh, bathtub uh, so that you don't drop water on the floor uh, you have such stepping mats there um, the interior of this house is uh, not so exciting for me uh, it's not that uh, Hmm. Not the structure of it. The, the structure is very fine, uh, but I see here too much of wood, too much of mm, yeah. It's just everything's so 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 similar. Yeah? Each room has has a similar wall design. That's that's something I wouldn't like to, to see inside. It's wood, glass smooth stone here and there a wool block and the occasional lamp um, as far as it can be considered um, part of the uh, room part of the or no not just the furniture I'm a bit um, lost in this house yes that, that's the way I, I can't can find the way but here we see kitchen small yes, at least something look at the ceiling here that is at least something uh, distinguishable um, where, whereby we can see well such ceiling is, is not found in any other room But other than that, we have everywhere the same. Mm, that's a bit pity. I know the, uh, these these pictures are trying to make it feel cozy and comfortable here. Mm, my eyes my eyes are too distracted by the by the interior. Too many blocks of different materials 
they are somehow not coherent, um, not harmonizing together. If I imagine all this structure in calmer, a more unified uh, design, I would like it more. At the outside, it's 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 not that bad because you have really wood and grass dominating. Well, this alteration between smooth stone and double slab here. Mm, is a bit too much, but, but still, I think my my house in Olympia was even a more varied. No, I think I like the outside of this house. It's 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 really nice. That's a that's a good job, and um, out from from the outside, the house looks just fine. But as I have seen the inside now. It has so many rooms, and each room is somehow missing something individual, something characteristic. The house, as as such, the outside has characteristic features, looking nice. Um, that's why I decided to record it. Yet when I see it from the inside. Mm, I don't feel comfortable here in, 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 in this house. Anyway, I don't want to uh, uh, discuss it any longer. It's definitely a house worth of noting um, as far as, um, as, as uh, it goes, I like it. This idea of these uh, rooflets over the windows is nice. I think I have seen, I don't know where, um, also, uh, the trapdoors extended like like these slab stones over the windows um, makes uh, sometimes a good good impression on a house. Yes, I've seen it on, on a medieval style house um, picture, not on our server. There is somebody yet to build such a house. Um, yeah, the inside. I I don't know a solution to it because what I like from the outside, I don't like from the inside. Especially when I see it in every single room. For a house with that many rooms, I would like something calmer as as a, as a design. Making um, two block thick walls. Hmm. I don't know how to deal with that. I've never actually tried it in a house uh, consistently. Yeah. And then, uh, does it have a, c uh, a cellar? Probably not. I think I've asked that. No, it hasn't. So there, are, there are little bits of I like from the inside. It's it's the library, it's the kitchen, the computer, cold bath. Also, the th uh, how these stairs are made. They are, um, are very realistic. This staircase. Oh, look at this! Of course, look at this um, lamp. A double lamp. How is it hanging? from the ceiling. These two fence pole connecting, these interconnecting beams here make it look more robust. Um, that's actually uh, nice. I like that. I could use it in a castle when I have, I have a big chandelier hanging from from the ceiling. Something robust must be there, and it's going to be this. Yes, um, but I don't know whether it's the whether it's the floor 
checkered pattern everywhere. And there is just no place where my eye can relax in the inside this house. So that's something I'm missing. Yeah. Um, but all in all, a good house, uh, much better than uh, most of the people have. Well, many of the people have built here. And, um, so lemon bean certainly um, is a um, builder which can build big things and finish them. It's it's uh, really important to finish things and um, decorate things around. Like in this garden, he has made um, these hedges and um, swimming pool and has finished the work with f ferny, uh, furnituring the house inside. I rarely do that. When I build a house, I don't like to do the interiors, but he made it. So a noteworthy house, at least he's made it <laughs> to to my reviews, and that's quite a success. Thanks, Lemon Bean, for showing me your house. There are quite some ideas I will like to use. <laughs>